Today's video is sponsored by absolutely nobody because I don't have enough subscribers to get a sponsorship. But y'all can fix that by subscribing to the channel, so do it. Ah, uh, Robert Freeman. Robert Freeman. Robert Free Man. Now, first of all, I want to start by saying this. I love Granddad, but bro, homeboy got serious problems. For starters, he has got to be the horniest person I've ever seen in my life. And I'm talking even more so than the booty warrior. Because the links that this dude will go to just to get him some ass is crazy. The nigga literally once had Tom Dubois, his neighbor, who was possessed by a stink meaner, and yet his whole concern was still trying to go on a date. Dude, the nigga was literally just trying to kill you about five minutes ago. And you thinking about booty. He talked about some coming. Like my nigga, if you don't get your George Jefferson hairstyle having ass, your red Sanford face having ass, pot belly borderline pedophilia ass, like seriously, you can't tell me that this man not on some creeper time. Like this nigga about 90 years old and almost every single girl that he ends up dating is in their like early to mid 20s. There's there, there, there's something up with that in my opinion. Like, 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 like you not Hugh Hefner, my nigga. Like you not that dude, my nigga. Nah. And you know what? Here's the thing. It would be fine if he was one of those guys who has sex with younger women, but is also attracted to women his own age too. But have you ever noticed how anytime he's dealing with a woman who's near his age, he's always disgusted by him? Like I'll give you an example here. Now in this scene, Robert is doing a lot of online dating and he discovers just how much you can get catfish whenever you're dating online. And basically the joke is none of the women that show up look like they do in their profile. But if you actually look at them, these are clearly just photos from when they were younger. Now, at the same time, they shouldn't be using old photos. Like, in my opinion on that stuff is, if you're going to take photos for your date nap, keep it recent. Especially when you know you look like this. Like, you got to give a homie some time to mentally prepare for what they're about to be dealing with. You know, like, make sure I got some extra wine so that that way I can, you know, have some help to actually do this. And yes, I mean tonight because I'm not taking you on no date and I get no booty behind it. Drop them panty drawers. We'll figure something out. But at the same time, you can argue that they don't look like their photo anymore. But let's be real here, Robert. It ain't exactly like you look like how you did 50 years ago. Hell, to be honest, you don't even look exactly like how you do in your own profiles because the nigga literally photoshopped himself to look like he's more muscular than he is. And that cringy photo that he took where he was making himself look like he was Brazilian with a fake wavy hair. Not to mention those fabricated stories that he be making up about himself. Nigga talking about that he was a heavyweight world champion. Shut your bitch ass up, nigga. You a belt world champion. I'll give you that much. You can whoop somebody with a belt, but you don't really seem to be too good off of hands alone. But something else I don't understand about Robert is, why is it that he's so selective about when he cares about when Huey and Riley are doing something? Like, for example, Huey and Riley cuss a lot. But only every once in a while Robert bothers to tell them to watch their mouths. Talking about some quick cussing. Like this is what I meant when I made my last video on him when I say that he's such an inconsistent character. Like the guy just picks the weirdest possible times to be concerned about them. One minute he wants Riley to stop hanging out with that bad kid LaMilton. And then the next he's letting his grandkids get killed by stink meter clones. Like where's the consistency in any of this? Do you love him or not? Make up your mind old man. And for the love of God, put some damn clothes on. Like, why are you always trying to be naked all the time? It's really weird. Especially around your grandkids of all people. Like, it's gotten to the point where they're just used to it now. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you want to give your boys some support, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. Or maybe drop me a like, because it really helps out with the algorithm. Or if you want to see me more in my unfiltered element, go hit up my Instagram. Always a fun time there. But I'm done for right now. Alright, bye.